Roy Dean Birch December 20, 1927 to August 4, 1991, was an American lawyer and lobbyist. He served as chairman of the Federal Communications Commission FCC from October 1969 to March 1974 and counselor to the president in 1974, during the administrations of U.S. President Richard M. Nixon and Gerald Ford. From 1964 to 1965, he was the chairman of the Republican National Committee, during the Barry Goldwater presidential campaign. Topic life and career Birch was born in Enid, Oklahoma. He earned a Bachelor of Laws degree from the University of Arizona in Tucson, Arizona, where he began his own law practice. Birch began working in 1955 on Goldwater's staff. He headed the National Party while Denison Kitchell, a Phoenix lawyer, was the National Goldwater campaign chairman. Because of the weak Republican performance in the 1964 elections, Birch was replaced early in 1965 by Ray C. Bliss of Ohio. In 1968, Birch worked in the campaign to return Goldwater to the U.S. Senate for the seat vacated by retiring Democrat Carl Hayden. Because of his presidential nomination, Goldwater gave up his Senate seat but returned to the upper chamber after a four-year absence and served another 18 years. As the FCC chairman, Birch advocated for more and better programs for younger audiences. The network soon revised the Saturday morning schedules. Under Birch, a study was conducted to determine whether one company should be allowed to own a daily newspaper and a television station in the same city. In 1975, shortly after Birch left the commission, the FCC unanimously prohibited the formation of new combinations of newspapers and broadcasting stations but allowed existing ones to continue. In 1980, Birch was chief of staff on the Republican vice presidential campaign of George Herbert Walker Bush, the running mate of Ronald W. Reagan. From 1959 to 1963 and again from 1965 to 1969, Birch was a partner in the law firm of Dunseeth, Stubbs and Birch in Tucson. From 1975 to 1987, he was affiliated with Pearson, Ball and Dowd in Washington, D.C. From 1987 until his death from bladder cancer at 63 years old, Birch was Director General of Intelsat, the Global Satellite Consortium. In the preceding decades, he was a telecommunications lawyer and White House counselor. Sources New York Times obituary <inaudible>